Hello everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how to compress video to reduce video size using Wondershare Unit Converter. The video compression feature of the software allows you to resize and reduce files. You can either choose the automatic compression feature of the software or you can opt to select your own file size or other specific parameters like the bitrate or audio bitrate to compress the file. And then after that you can preview the first 20 seconds of the compressed file to see if it's the way you want it to be before you confirm your final changes. So let's go ahead and take a look at the steps to compress videos using Wondershare Unit Converter. Step 1 is to of course launch the program and then we're going to choose the compressor feature or the video compressor feature inside of the software. Then step 2 is we need to add videos to compress. You can either drag them and drop them in this area here or click to navigate to your files. Once you select your files, they should load up in the UI pretty quickly. And then step three is to select the file size and other parameters we want to set to compress our video. To do this, we're gonna click on the settings option and this will allow us to fully customize our video compression settings. So you can go through and do several things. The first of which is you can set a custom file size. If you have a predefined file size limit, you may have to go below, say it was two megabytes. We can set a specific file size below that and it will automatically set the compression settings we need. You can also set up it based on the type of video format and it will tell you also in general what the quality of your compression will be and the final uh, quality preset. Then the last two more advanced options if you want, you can select a new compression resolution. So you can either upscale or downscale your footage. And then lastly, you can set a custom bitrate uh, to set the custom video bitrate to say maybe 1200 kilobits per second. And then finally, you can preview your compressed video to make sure that it's not too compressed and retains the quality that you need with the size you need. And then finally, step four is to compress our video. To do this, of course, you can hit OK to save the settings, or if you wanted to get rid of the settings, hit Reset. So we've set the compression settings. Now all we need to do is hit Compress next to our specific video, or Start All if you have many things queued up. And this will begin the process of compressing our video using the settings that we previously selected. And then once it's complete, you should see a success sign and you can go into your finished video compressions to view your finally outputted compressed video using whatever settings you set up. And that's gonna do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. That's how to compress video to reduce video size using Wondershare Uniconverter.